Welcome back to, I almost said Mars Warlogs, which is fair, it's pretty much the same game. Welcome back to Technomancer. Um, let's hop down and see what these shrimp boys want. Oh, they heard me take out my shield. Whoa, there's a big one. Alright, who wants to jump at me? I want to try and parry. Well, I can't parry that. I can't see. You guys are rude. Ha, get fucked. Can I skin? I can skin. That's... I skinned the wrong one. It's weird. I took a lot of damage there because I'm an idiot. There we go. Let's quick heal. Um, I do have explosive traps, which... I don't think I'm going to have the time to place during the actual boss fight. <laughs> we'll have a, a single explosive trap. Look, more. There's another big one. We're going to have to go down in the middle there. But first, let's fight these fuckers. Hello? I think they saw me. Oh yeah, they, they know I'm here. Oh, you bitch. Why do you take more than one of those? Wow, you get poisoned, they get real aggressive. It's like they're somehow under the impression that because you got poisoned, you're an easy target now. The answer is nope. Um, increases the attack damage by 10%, increases the chance of knocking enemy over, or... Increase the disruption chance of all mace attacks, damage of all mace attacks. I gotta go disruption on this one, at least. Um, because as much as I like the damage of my mace attacks, I do, I do want that. Why is this one lit up? Oh, my protective goggles already do that? What? Huh? Protective goggles. Oh, plus one exploration. Neat. So once I have... Oh. That's good to know. So I would have had this if I... Huh. With VFX. How do we use VFX? I'm sure that's a thing that'll come up later. Um, pick lot. No, not yet. Proof traps that don't do more damage. Oh, I do have this one. All right, cool. But I want crafting, science, charisma, probably. Yeah, one of these three. Um, let's go crafting. Crafting is a thing that I enjoy doing. All right. Yep, I got two different skin points. Skin points. Skill points. So I'm pretty sure the only reason I can skin these guys is because of the goggles, and honestly, I'm okay with that. Because, uh, I feel like that's why those are a guaranteed loot item. Because it's the same, no matter what, you get the, seem to get protective goggles off that one corpse, and I feel like that's just so easy. You can do that. Hey, exploding traps. Alright. I have a lot of healing gel now. That is going to come in handy. Alright, so the way the shrimp came in seemed to be somewhere around here. Ah, there we go. Look at all the big boys. Who wants to get Zap first? Zap, Zap, they did. Yeah, it seems to be their entire technique is let the big and poison you, and then when you're blind, they rush you. Well, look at that! There we go, that was easy! Right? I killed the, the shrimp. It's not like they have some sort of Matriarch, right? Oh. They do. It's probably displeased with my actions, then. So this is a thing. Hi there. You have quite the sack hanging from your chest, I must say. Probably sucks when that thing gets damaged, doesn't it? <laughs> Sudden cut to me having the goggles on. Because he takes your goggles off during cutscenes. Whoop, giant mantis. Alright. Okie dokie. I don't think blocking you is going to do much good. Oh. Alright. Well, that hurt. Uh, let's see what happens when I. No. Oh. God damn you hit. Close the trap down. Uh, I put two. That is fast. Well, I did four damage. That's cool. What the fuck? Alright. 
do that then. Let's try this. Am I damaging you? Whoa! Well, cool. Cool. Great. Let's get back into the. No, no, no. Get, give me your stomach again. Uh. Never mind. That's fine. Hi. Oh, God. Yeah, it doesn't like it when you hit that sack. Don't know why. Ugh. I'm doing a lot of damage, and so is it. No. Alright. I don't think I can block, so I'm just gonna not try. One of these mines seems to be disappeared. <laughs> Figured out why. No. Also, they seem to damage each other, so I don't think this is actually a matriarch. Or... Friendly fire is just a thing, and this thing does a lot of area effect shit. No, no, give me the sack. Ugh. Come on, don't you protect that shit from me. Oh, that's what you're doing. Alright, that's fair. Alright, there we go. You're gonna keep doing that, huh? I assumed egg sack? What is this? Ugh. Heal. That's not what I clicked. Heal me. Oh, it's ramming time. I don't know. Maybe not. Zap, zap. I'm just gonna deal with... Come here. No. Thank you. No, I don't have to deal with it. I like that. No. Nope. Nope. Okay. Well, that did a lot more damage to me than it did you, but now I'm inside your egg sack. Ha-ha! <laughs> Alright. Oh, goggles are gone, so this is actually just full cuss. <laughs> I have the power! Hello, Sean. You seem... suddenly capable of actually... Lots of flashing. Suddenly capable of actually damaging things. Surprising. Ah, great! I passed that and finished the initiation. Go me! What's up? I'm a little bit, uh, charged up. <laughs> uh, thank you for the help. So there we go, we saved the dome from the Great Mantis. Giant Mantis, Giant Mantis. So there we go, that's tutorial finished. Told you we finished it in this episode. Now we're getting into areas of things that I don't remember. Remember to assign your skill points each time you earn a... Ah, yes. Time to be promoted. Hi there. You seem like a dick. Just saying. You. Who bore witness to the secret with your own eyes. Yes. Who knows in your heart of hearts that the revelation that he bears is true, and who has understood that this knowledge could cast us into endless pits of despair. As you drink the sap of the world, the water that feeds our lives, water abandon is important. the one you thought you were, and instead become our brother, Zachariah Manser. Okay. Together we have shared the water and secret. Can you swear to forever protect the knowledge of the Earth and to dedicate your life to finding it again? To defend and protect our secret, even with the sacrifice of your life, if need be? I swear. Then welcome, my brother. Ah, sweet. Kind of had like a, a daddy feeling from you, but I guess I guess brother's fine too. You know that's still <clears throat> still gets into the Game of Thrones itch that I need scratching. Hmm. I mean, honestly, compared to Mars Warlocks, Sean Manser does look uh, much tastier in this one. I know you must be troubled by what you've learned, huh? and I assure you that it's no less troubling to me. Wow. 
but be proud of what you are a mutant. and know no matter what we are by your side well that's because you're also mutants and that this initiation <laughs> as horrid as it may be makes you forever our brother you yes because we're all the courage mutants. of lions beneath the dome did i and for it you have been made an officer okay so i imagine now that you no longer need my guidance it will send me elsewhere with the great and endless pride of having been your teacher to a pow camp years. somewhere where you will die be trained somewhere mine, else master. no not master it's just sean now can i still call you daddy no. though take your assignment as an officer count the blessings you've amounted those that allowed you to avoid the front thus far captain eliza is waiting in the barracks she's harsh but fair okay but before you find her we all know the regulations Technomancers get no leave from the front in times of war. Okay. So being here, I can't even sneeze without a report being written up. But you, you have a free pass. I need you to go to the exchange district for me. There's an itinerant merchant there who was supposed to arrive yesterday. Just meet with him. Okay. The merchants have no ties to abundance and travel among us like shadows. They hear things, whisper things, and pay people to forget they are there. I'm looking for information on any archaeological discoveries that could expose the Earthlings. Information that would help protect our secret. Expose Ask the him if they've heard of any such finds. Yes, Great Master, as you wish. Good. Exactly. The as you wish seemed fine, but, but yes, Great Master seems. Uh, you're after. Not a single soul can hear your exchange off. with the merchants. Like they just sat him down in front of. From the script, was like, yeah, just read, it's fine. Uh, objectives press L. Okie dokie. So, fighting for abundance. Get your assignment from Captain. All right, finding Earth. Obtain information with the merchants. Merchant rumors. Interrogate the merchants. Okay. Uh, so, if I do that. Ah. Okay. So, I do that. Now, if I. That was actually looking. Are they both on my map? Yeah, they're both on my map now. All right, cool. Let's do that, so I know where I have to go. This is a big map. All right. Yeah. Holy shit. So I made it over to here before and like looked at this stuff and was like, neat. And then, uh, good God, there's the slums, the slums, the underworks. There's merchant. Wait, what? Tom. Tom Goodsman and oh, Joe Goodsman. It's like they're both the same person. How is he in two places at once? Alright, let's find some loot. I'm sure as a Technomancer, who works for the military, I have the option to... Huh. Oh, I can climb up. Can't go through here. Never mind. I'm gonna knock that down first somewhere. Hi there, madam. I guess I'm going this way. Running! Hello, whoever you are. I'm sure it doesn't actually fucking matter. Interesting art. Let's be some of that outsider art the Simpsons told me about. <gasps> a trash can to root around it. Yes. Excellent. I got some electrical debris. Why do you look like you're waiting for someone? Is it me? I think it might be me. Um, my god. I guess just look for glowing blue and run to it. Otherwise, just fucking go. Oh, there's where the training. That's where I was at the start. I cannot drop down. Does that mean... Yeah, right over here is where I did my combat training. Interesting. I didn't realize that before when I came through here because I wasn't paying attention. You're red. Does that mean I can't pick... Oh, I can! Haha! -ha. Red means it has to be picked. And I had the picking. Picking powers. The power to pick. I don't know what I'm saying, man. All right. Hi there, whoever you are. Workbench. I hope there's anything else I really need to do with that, so I'm just going to not. Um, Ryan Stewart. Is Zachariah Manser? Yes. Reputation precedes you. Why would I have reputation? Promotion well deserved, I hear. I'm okay. Quartermaster Ryan Stewart, in charge of logistics in this barracks. Right. Equipment problems or improvement, or you need to collect your pay, I'm your man. Pleasure, Quartermaster. Yeah, it feels like they spliced two attempts. Like, alright, you're gonna say pleasure, quartermaster. Pleasure, quartermaster. No, no, you, you have to say them as if they're both part of the same sentence. 
Oh, okay. Pleasure, quartermaster. Yeah, Unfortunately, that this is beyond my skill what level. I... <sighs> All right. Do you mind? You can't steal. Oh, under your ally's nose. Oh. Why not? Ooh, look at all the things in there, though. Does that mean there's going to be a point where you're not my ally? You are quest, so I'm not going to do that yet. Hello. What do I got? Metal components. Nice. Fortunately, this is yeah. Yeah, I realized immediately when I clicked it. Where's your? You two are recruitable or something? I don't know. Um. Enter code. Oh. I mean, this is my locker? I mean, it has a single piece of leather in it, so it might be. Level 2 lock and enter code. Oh. Open. Can't search. Actually, ah, level 1 lock. That one I can do. Yoink. Worth it. So I think this is supposed to be my room because I can store items here. I have a bed, and this is, I guess, my workbench. All right, I am gonna upgrade my my Tonto. Feel like my dagger should be focusing on crit. I really also just like the look of that. Like, look at that. Look how terrifying that is. I mean, nah. That also is kind of fun because I just like the idea of that being there, but. Stabby, stabby. So if I get the blade all the way up to the hilt when I jam it into you, guess what? I mean, you're probably already fucking dead, so it doesn't matter. Welcome to your room. You'll come across several during your adventure. Blah, blah, blah. That's fine. Uh, we're going out this way so we can head to the merchants. Wrong button. All right, so the merchants are... Uh, rotate, please. I want to go... For yeah, second left. I want to take the second left to get to the merchants. Okie dokie. I need to actually take the stairs. There is no jumping. Oh, look, girls. While exploring, you can display the thumbnail map of your surrounding area with F. Oh. Okay. That's actually kind of helpful. I have to hold F for it. But, uh, still good to know. Watch your trash cans! It's very important that I loot the garbage. This is a yeah, this is I'm gonna have to go over there. I'm sorry, I avoided I didn't end up going towards the building that said girls, girls, girls. Wait, master said ah. the caravan would be right here. But the stand looks like it's been deserted. No question <sighs> neighboring there's... merchants. Okay. So it would have been right there. Let's talk to you. Sup, Tom? Mr. Manser, it's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Big on weaponry, I hope. What can I get you? Lots of things. Um Talk about a disappearing I was expecting caravan. a caravan in the stall next door to buy a few things. They arrived yesterday, but truth be told, I think they found some trouble. Oh. I wasn't there when it happened, but from what I heard, some people were looking to talk. Then talking turned to shouting, and after that, they were seen down in the slums, I hear, and then they were dragged into some warehouse. Whatever they did, they're in big trouble now. And if you're looking to help them, you better find them fast. Great, so I'm going to the slums. What do you got for merchandise? Got a serrated Tonto. Kukri. Kukri could be fun. Uh, Kosh, which I can't... I don't have the strength for. That's fair. Monkey Wrench. I already had one of those. Open work tube. Staff. Reinforced soldier shield. I already have one soldier shield, so I'm using precision gun. It's like a nail gun, only more precise. Cadet's glove. Armor. Nothing. I guess you did say big on weaponry, so I guess the assumption here is you only have weapons. All right, well, there is another salesman. What? Is this? Why is there a bunch of question marks right here? What? Search zone. Okay. How large is this zone I have to search? It's not going to tell me. It's just this is the center of a zone I have to search. Or are you telling me I have to search right here? Because there's nothing here that's interactable. Is it you? Can I talk to you? No. There's another merchant over here. See the Shh. They're unstable. Anything can set them off. 
Let's talk about something else. Yeah, let's talk about me. Okay. What's up? Okay. We never see him around these parts. Wouldn't want to set me off, now would we? Alright, uh, you. I talked to your brother, maybe? Hello. Hello, Joe. Hello. Looking for some medicine? Drugs? Ingredients, maybe? Do you have a brother that sells, uh, Mr. Caravan? Can you help me? I'm looking for any information on your, the Your buddy said he went to the slums. Do you have the same information? I don't know. My, my memory sometimes needs incentive to remember. I have incentive. Electrical incentive. I have 50% chance of success with every reason, or I can just give 10 serum. Friend. How about this? You tell me what you know, or you'll find yourself in a room with others who'll be a little bit more assertive in their efforts to refresh your memory. 50 for the shot. All right, already. Right. Yeah. I'll tell you what I know, but at great risk to my own ass. Well, I mean, it's great risk if you the don't. Of the, Bori, uh, of the underworld. So sure. these overpriced foreign merchants did something to piss them off. Didn't pay their right of passage or protection serum or something. Right. Whatever the hell it was. They were kidnapped. That's all I know. Where they are, oh. or even if they're still alive, I haven't the damnedest clue. For that, you'll have to ask the Vori. Okay. So I have now to go. do Joe a favor. Take this herb and get the hell out before you raise suspicions. Oh, sweet. Thanks. Cool. Cool. Uh, negotiate with the Vori. I, I thought I was just going to go to the slum and kill people, but sure, let's negotiate, I guess. Um, I still can't upgrade any of this stuff. It's a shame. And I don't know if I want to upgrade anything else right now. I mean, my shield. I do want to upgrade my shield. But I can't. Because I'm still lacking in metal components. <laughs> Makes sense. Can I not upgrade, upgrade the nail gun? Or am I yeah, I'm probably missing metal for that as well? Oh, I need. I can do that one. Oh, okay. So, damage upgrade. It has, like, I'm assuming, compressor on it to make it fire faster. Disruption upgrade. Laser pointer. And critical hit is a scope. Just, it's fair. Uh, well, I mean, I already have the dagger going for a crit, so I might as well have that entire stance built around a critical hit. Can I upgrade my staff? So the staff has three different points to upgrade. There's each tip, which basically just stick different things on it, turn it into a pole arm or a, you know, basically just a pole arm, which I'm all for. I love it. Look at this. Look how terrifying some of these are. Can you imagine getting hit with that? I fucking can't. Uh, and then the middle, you got different grips. Not a lot of difference there. And this end is the exact same as the other end. Just just stabby things. But we did have upgrades we could get for this. So let's grab the disruption. No, no, it doesn't make sense. Damage. Staff's going to be damaged. My shield's going to be focused on disruption. Because as it is, I'm pretty sure the shield already has an 80% chance of disruption, so upgrading it for disruption just seems like a better call. And the mace. Keep all the upgrades I have on the weapon set for damage, and then when it comes to getting level up stuff, I put the uh, disruption on it. Hi, I'm going to the slums. Nobody can stop me. Nobody's trying to. Don't know why I decided to announce that. This is all new to me now. I have done none of this. Oh, goody. Am I going to get attacked for no reason? Because I am in the slums. Yes, I know how to do that. That tip... Oh, my God. Jesus Christ, the map is huge again. What is that? Person of interest? Scott Seeker. Oh, that's the, the, the doctor, isn't it? The one who I ran into? Traitor, traitor. Anton Rogue. Negotiate with the Vor. Vore. Sam Rogue, Citizen, Ethan Host. Alright, well, I mean, that's where I have to go, so I might as well go that way, but I think that's the route I have to take. I have to go left and then up towards there. Alright. This way it is. Run, 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 run. Mixed feelings about the size of this map. I'm assuming I'm going to have a lot of time to explore. Really? Make the slightest move, you're a dead man. Sure you want to do this? Really? Want to pull this shit? Alright. Oh, jeez. Alright, boys. Alright, I need to switch targets. Oh, we got a guy with a gun, too. 
Can I pick the... Wow, there's a lot of you fuckers. Alright, hold on. Oh, that's poisonous. Wow. They have... God damn. What the fuck was I supposed to do? Well, that's a safe game. Which I'm assuming is when I entered the slums. So I didn't really lose a lot. He just pulled his fucking knife on me. He was like, you make the slightest move, you're gonna get gutted. I was like, ah, okay. Oh, hi. You seem fun. Hi there. Your name is? Alright, fine. Fair enough. Now, if I just fuck off, they're not even... Over there. No, 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 no. I'm gonna go a different way. You guys are gonna rush me over here? Oh, nice. Oh my god, this actually worked. Ha! <laughs> well, since I just started a clan war, apparently... Oh, they left. Alright, well, fine. Yeah, I thought I'd give the staff a try. That was a waste. Oh, good, there's more. Alright, well, come on, then. Let's go. Come on. Ah, I'm poisoned. Are we gonna do this shit or not? Okay. Did you heal? Hi. Make the slightest move, you're a dead man. Done. Alright, let's try and... Nope. Come on. No. The long wind-up ones are the ones I have the hardest problems carrying. Alright, next. Come on. Fuck. I'm gonna heal real quick. I'm really glad that I'm gonna just 300 this shit. Very helpful. Next. There we go. Yeah, I figured. Oh, well, here comes a different guy. One at a time, please. Nope. Oh, I didn't want to get shot at the same time. It's a good long wind up. Okay. Healing. Okay, that quick stab, real annoying. I can just watch one of the guys go for the guard. I have a feeling he's gonna regret that. Yep, there he is trying. That seems to be going well for him. Wow, you are just trapped. Um. <laughs> Alright, cool, cool. I'm gonna use another one of these, because... Bloody hell am I bad at this. I still can't drain anybody. Probably for the best. Ooh, precision gun! Nice, nice. Any more loot? No. That took far longer than it probably should have to win. But here we are. A cleaver! Which I can't use because I'm not agile. That's fine. But precision gun, you say? Let's see here. That is just better damage. Uh, I lose some chance of disruption. I lose 1% chance of critical, but that's because I, I applied that myself. Alright. And the cleaver, which, yeah, makes sense if we go over that. It is substantially better. And it's an upgrade for, I'm assuming, disruption. Is that damage? That's damage. That is a damage upgrade. That might be why it does so much more. Alright, well, I'll keep that for now. I have something else that's new in my equipment. What's this? Oh, a pass. You found this badge, which serves as a pass in the pockets of one of the Vori. Okay. Is that what I needed? I needed that so they left me, leave me the fuck alone? Well, I got it now, and I didn't kill your people. So, I think a thank you is in order. Because I don't have the ability to drain them yet. But, uh... That's kind of the point. Hi. 
you look like an enemy. You look like friendlies. So obviously the thing to do. Since this warehouse belongs to Anton Rogue and you ain't him, you should probably get Okay. I mean you make a very valid argument. <laughs> Since this doesn't belong to you, fuck off. Fair enough. Hi, are you guys chill? I mean I'm like one of you, right? So we're chill then? We are chill. Alright, cool. I don't actually need to go in here, but I just wanted to make sure we were chill. Shop, what do you sell, friend? Be there. Officer, hey there. hello. What can I do for the fine officer today? Check out my merchandise. I have everything you never need for hunting. Yes, of course. Hunting. That is what we'll be using this for. Ah, yeah, that's great. Um, selling. How do I... Ah, sale. Okay, I want to keep that. I think I do want to start selling stuff instead of recycling for a bit, though. Sell. There we go. Because I do need more... Yeah, I've already gotten rid of most things. You know what? I'm going to get rid of all of these. Because I don't really have any intention of using them. So, there we go. Exploding traps. Wish I hadn't used a bunch of those for no reason. Uh, purchase. Alright, what are you... You're just another weapon salesman. I mean, you do have... No, you have the nail gun I sold you. Radio. I didn't expect... Well, I mean, I guess I should have expected to have to use strength for some of the guardian weapons. Wait a second. This is not the way... Oh, I just assumed that that guy was over here, not down in there. <sighs> Alright, where... Is that the way I want to go? No. This... Well, if I can jump down... Over here, I'll be fine. Alright, cool. Wait. Did I hear that? Sorry, are you saying you want to fucking go? We're gonna tussle? There's only three of you. We do it? Oh, okay, so once I leave, they just like, fuck it. No, it doesn't matter. Alright, then I'll just go. Oh, this isn't where I want to jump down. I want to jump across that wall. And that wall is reinforced. That's not happening. You coming for me or not? Alright. Make up your mind. Night is about to fall. Time affects the quest and the lives of the characters you encounter. You can change the time of day by entering a room represented with that. Okay. Hi, ladies. I'm gonna go... I really hope this game doesn't have nudity at any point. I mean, Mars Warlogs didn't, but I'd rather not find out that some of these girls actually... Blue strip. You... Her legs keep changing color. Her skin tone all over the place keep changing color. I'm gonna go... Clearly she's trying to find the skin tone that works best. Am I walking in friendly like or are we doing this the hard way? Sorry, pal. Right. Nobody enters this office if they got no pass. I just happen to have a pass. All right, pal. I'm an officer and a technomancer, and I'm here to see Anton Rogue. And I already have a pass. You even know who Anton Rogue is? He's pass. Fucking multi pass? Here. Multi pass. I don't care if you're a damn general. Get the hell out of here. Multi pass. Give the hall pass. What else? Show it to me. All right, fine. You so, can come in even What like else? Like what about I have a pass? Eyes. I did. Sure did. What fuck you gonna do about it, huh? Anyway, uh, actually, before I go through that door, I saw this. I'm just gonna do that, and you can kiss my ass. Neat. I'm just gonna open this door. This door's locked from the other side. Oh. We're going around. I assume, but the way it was barred, that I'd have to... I had it backwards. I could have come in from that way and snuck in. Hi. That's where those three guys were there to protect it, so I could have snuck in from behind, Look but... what the cat dragged in. The prodigal son. Prodigal son. The yeah. diamond in the rough, risen from poor street trash to the godlike ranks of Technomancer. Now tell me, why am I so lucky to be in your presence? Um. Sure. I'm looking for a caravan of merchants. Okay. They were supposed to be in the exchange. Word is they were escorted knife. to the slums, and you may know something about it. Hmm. Yeah. Rude little man. My town. My streets. Three Uninvited competition who lack even the common decency to offer a little token <laughs> of grace in exchange for their presence. Okay. If you're ready to settle their debts, I'd be happy to usher them back home. Um, 
Sure. These merchants not giving it 150 some fucking outside things. business that requires interrogation as soon as possible. You can either help me find them, or we can always turn our attention towards your business affairs. Your call, Anton. I hear your threat, man. Shit. But well, serum is serum. And I'd rather deal with you than swallow the debt those outcasts owe me. It's just business. Mm -hmm. Pay their debt, and I'll help. Don't, and I'm happy to just show you the door. Do we have another option? <sighs> Sorry, but I'm not in the habit of paying other people's debts. Yeah, I, I don't. And I'm afraid I'm do this that. conversation's over. Pity, really. Could have been mutually beneficial. Don't let the door hit you in the ass on your way out. Is it time to practice my combat abilities? Oh, okay. Information on characters. The soldiers. The ASC. What about the ASC? What can you tell me? Nothing Why would he you want to? Don't already need to know. Okay. Little happens that they don't see or hear, and their colonel's control over abundance grows with each passing day. Yeah, that explains. I'm not telling you anything world. else for free. Makes sense. You are a greedy little shit. Resistance. What do you know about the resistance? <laughs> Enough to handle my own business unimpeded. We don't think that they are any danger. They're an occasional client when they're in need of weapons or explosives. Makes sense. Their biggest strength comes from how deeply underestimated they are. Ever stepped in a puddle that turned out to be a ditch? <laughs> Not. I have actually. All right, the technomancers. What's your opinion of technomancers? What are you doing I'll try to me? tread lightly with this mancer. Unfortunately for abundance, you're becoming relics. Okay. A dying breed. Due to the disgraceful misuse of what could very well be one of its greatest, though misspent, assets. Makes On the sense. battlefield alone, for sure, the brute force of you Technomancers is unmatched. And when coupled with the fact that you're the keepers of terrestrial knowledge, it's a combination quite capable of reducing empires to faded memories, isn't it? Could be, if I learn how to use things properly. Army? You're a hard one to peg, rogue. Why would you care what I think? But sure, I don't know, not? but I guess Just I keep interrogating you for fun. Conversation. Yeah, that's what we're doing. You're Abundance told me to and its generals fuck off, like but I'm going to keep talking. tree that has long since withered away. Uh -huh. Its leaves dried up, but still clinging to the branches of memories stretching from the trunk of its faded but glorious past. Strangled you know, very by its positive own ancient and outlook at most things, huh? All the while, Aurora's strength blossoms from the aggressive dynamics. What is the ASC that? But is that I'm the Aurora sure Soldier Corps? It work itself out in time. What is the difference between it and the soldiers? Field, then undoubtedly in offices like these, and of our dear Colonel Victor. All right, locations. Oh my God, no, no, then I think go. we're good. Then go. So. Am I capable of just starting a fight here? I'm gonna, I'm gonna save because I feel like I'm about to do something that might be widely regarded as stupid. Hi. Nope. All right. Well, what if I do this? I. That's a this level is three my lock. Skill level. Do that one. No, I can't. I'm level one lockpicking. Put that away. What about this? You gonna get mad at me? Ooh, light vor jacket. I know it's a Vore jacket, but whatever. Really? Nobody gave a shit about that? Cool, let me just put on your jacket then. Probably. Jesus, yes. Increases my traps and lockpicking skill. Now I can go to the level 2 lock. Cool. Thanks, guys. Look, I'm uh, one of you now. Anyway. I love that that's a thing. Pick level 1 lock. Get the ability to pick the level 2 lock from the clothing inside. Fantastic. Well, I guess I'm going to go. But... Hold on. Uh, P. Where... Quests. Nope. Quests. Quests. Chain information about the merchants. Negotiate with the Vori. I don't really want to. But... One guy did say at a warehouse... We already know the warehouse up here belongs to him. Wait, there's also... Where'd they go? Apparently this is another camp. There was other characters on this map. 
other people of interest. Where'd they go? They were like over here. Uh huh. There's a lot of people of interest that are gone now. Weird. I'm gonna head over here though, because I feel like that's over there. One of these is where I want to go. I'm gonna go over there. Where they were like, ah, this belongs to Anton Rogue. You're not him. Fuck off. Hi. Hold on. Be right with you. Okay, that doesn't pause. Move, you're a dead man. Well, I guess we're doing this. Who's first? Make the slightest move, you're a dead man. Alright. Jesus Christ, you guys are good at that. Alright, try this again. Root. Great. Oh, well, fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck you. Ow. Alright, hold on. Hold on. Let me heal, which I can do while moving, which is great. Alright, we doing this? Oh, you want to fuck off now, do you? No, you don't. Come on. Fuck me. Uh, I'm dying. Heal me. Heal. Fuck. <sighs> Let me just re get to that point. This, uh, much like with Mars Warlocks, the, the combat is difficult to get the hang of. Oh, I got everything. Oh, cool. It just saved when I left. Apparently. Good to know. Now, where the fuck? I went up there. Oh, I see where I wanted to go. Oh, yeah. That's where I fucking came from. Why are they suddenly aggressive right there? Whatever. Maybe I just ran bad and fast enough the last time that I didn't notice. Yeah, probably because I went like this. Oh, they're not even there this time. Alright, I guess I was just unlucky. Cool. Saving. So, you and I, we're Since probably gonna have an issue. To That's nice. Zap, zap. I can't really see. I can see when you're about to hit me. Oh, oh good, they got back up. Yeah. Friendly fire. Good job, guys. Stop the gun, please. One down. Bites the dust. What? I hit you. There we go. Alright, so there was more that I guess wanted to get involved and then decided to fuck off. Which I guess that's fine. Free the merchants. Yeah, see, I thought so. I figured if I just climbed in here, I'd be fine. Oh, hey, I got another Vory jacket. Wow, that's a better Vory jacket, apparently, because it's not light anymore. So there we go. Let's wear the heavy jacket. What else did I get? Oh, I got another pass. And the warehouse key! What luck! So there's a door over here, which I'm assuming... Oh, this is not at all what I thought I was going to. But I'll take it. The map implies that you can go... Oh, so I could have gone over there, climbed around behind, and done the sneaky thing. But I'm just really not sneaky. I mean, that's what happens when you're a guardian, not a rogue, I guess. Hi. Zap. Uh, Alright. Okay. I heard someone else say something. Ah, great poison. 
Ah. Got you. That's good. Fuck me. One down. I need to fucking dodge. Heal. Nope. No, no. I'm tired. What? What the fuck? That's a thing that can happen? You're tired. Rest by going to your room marked with the symbol... What the fuck? I've never played a game that actually required you to sleep. That's not true. I played very few games that require you to sleep. So what, you want me to like sneak past him? Fuck that. Fuck you. Hey, yeah, come on. Yeah, come on. Come get me. Fuck me. Perfect. One down. Next. I don't like when it slow mo's on nothing. Perfect. Much better. Ow. Well, that's only a poison chance and not a guaranteed poison. Fuck all three of you. Oh, and the past. You are tired. Rest makes you more effective. You gain an experience bonus. Oh, so I, it's literally just I don't have... Um, well rested is what I'm getting from this. What if I just give them all my passes and be like, all right, cool, you made your point. So I've definitely found more than one pass now. Ah, that's where the goal is. But uh, there's loot. And I want to loot before I do that. Nice. I didn't actually check. Does the jacket have... It does. Okay, cool. It's like, oh shit, did I lose my level 2 lockpick ability? I did not. Alright. Exploding trap. Very nice. I should probably be using those more often. Uh, we're going to save because I, one, successfully killed those three, and two, I, I got loot. So what's through here? Doors locked from the other side. I guess we're going around. Did I say level three? I bet I didn't say level three. I mean, I opened it, so I guess clearly couldn't have. Hi. You don't look like a friend, but, you know, whatever. Level one lock. Open. Hey, worker's shoes. I think I already had those, though. Hi, I'll be right with you. I'm just gonna loot your shit. Cool. Uh, which one of you fuckers do I talk to? You. Who are you? You don't look like a guard to me. I'm wearing sandals. Those You're are some weird-looking toes. Name's Zachariah Manser, lieutenant in Ophir. Yeah, the that's me. The merchant who got himself kidnapped from the exchange. I'm here to get you out. Correct. I am. I am indeed. Fierro, master of the caravan. Master of the caravan. The shadows if you're a master, protect. why are you... whatever. But I doubt you came to help us out of the generosity of spirit. Am I correct in that presumption? Yes. Ian Manser, great master of the Technomancers, sent me to talk to you. Yep. Ah, I see. Yes. One of my favorite clients. <sighs> and a man with whom I, uh -oh. indeed, have some information to share. Aurora has discovered a new site. Not far from the Shadow Path. A site filled with objects of that incredible condition. That guy's missing an arm. And even a relic, as the rumor has it. News I'm sure the Great Master will be glad to hear. Probably. You should go now. Get back on the exchange as quick as you can. Yep. I'm not one to dally, Manson. I'll Good. see you around, I'm sure. I have doubts. Alright. Your one-armed guard is gone with you. It's fine. Hi! You seem unhappy with me. I don't understand why. No, no. Ugh. As usual, the biggest issue with this game is how easy it is to get stun locked. He's got to be able to. You really have to play defensively, basically. Fuck. Which I'm not good at. Either defensively. Well, I mean, even with the dodge rolling, it's you have to play fast but still defensive. It should have saved. Yeah, right there. Hi. I'm doomed. 
I need to get out of that fucking corner. That's what I need to do. You're a Technomancer. Technomancer provides you with def destructive abilities. Electric fist, electric weapon. Yeah, the, the fist is definitely the go-to. Hi. I'm gonna go this way. <sighs> what the fucking, what the hell? I'm hitting Q and it's not even coming up anymore. There we go. Cool. Cool. I hit Q like three times in the middle of that fight and they just kept hitting me instead. And I was like, alright, Q. I'm holding it down. Wham. Excuse me? Alright. We doing this? Whoop. That's gonna hurt. You. Good. Got both of them. Just really start using the fact that I can place those really quickly more to my advantage. Clearly. Oh, good. Another cleaver that I can't use. <sighs> Is it... It's strength, right? I just want to make sure of that before I do my level... Oh, it doesn't matter. Okay. I was thought maybe that this level might be one of the ones where I get one of these. It is not. Guardian. Let's do counterattack, because I want to be having that parry be more worthwhile. Vent of a last second parry knocks the enemy back and strikes him with a quick mace attack. The time you have to launch a counterattack is a bit longer. Okay, the attack following it as I'm at critical. Ooh, that's a tough call. Let you perform another action more quickly after parrying. Also good. Alright. So, Cleaver. Still can't use it. I have two of them now. And they require... Yeah, I thought it was agility. Makes sense. It's a rogue weapon. Uh, did they decide this is openable now? Door's locked from yeah, the I figured not. Guess we're going around. Where? Where did I get to there? Is it like a climb from somewhere else? Or... So I'm not seeing any path that connects. Oh, whatever. Irrelevant. It's probably something that I have to do some other time. And now is not that time. Backup show up here, too? Sure did. I count one. Oh, well, he saw me. Two, three. Oh, nope. No, that's alright. Hey, what do you think of that? Perfect parry. Rude. Still trying to get this down. I dodged you. That's alright. Stop with the shooting, please. There we go. Next. Oh, I hit him. I would have hit him. God damn. Can you imagine if I tried to do this on extreme? Fuck, I'd be already salty as hell. As it is, I'm kind of getting salty as hell right now. Who saw me? Ah, oh, that guy. That'll do it. Uh, zap. <laughs> yeah, whoa, hi. Where'd you come from? Bump. Bump. The thing is, I don't even have to be doing these fights right now. I could just fuck off, I'm sure. But I need the experience and I need the loot. Not just, like, the experience I get from combat, like, the in-game thing. We need to get better at that. Because if I can get... If I can get really good at parrying, get the timing down and all that... Come on. Next. That's all right. I'm gonna try and... Well, that went... Significantly better. Like almost. Ooh, curved serrated dagger. I don't know if that's better than the cleaver or not, but neat high resistance gun. Should have a lot of things. Oh, there's enemies over there. There's guards over there. Um, where am I going now? Hold on. Uh, yeah, I got a new weapon. That's nice. Is it just done? Oh, report back to the Grand Master. Alright, so I gotta go back up top, then. Uh, map. Can I fast travel? <laughs> Probably not. Yeah, I just gotta go back up to the exchange. Um, alright. Which means... If I'm reading this, yeah, I can go through here. Say hello to the prostitutes so I can avoid combat. Hi, friends. Yeah, bye, friends. I'm okay without. I've killed enough of you at this point. I got to level 6. 
actually. Yeah, they fucked off. When? So I got a level 7, I get one of these. 9, 7. Alright. That's fair. I'm. No, well. I'm getting there. Save. I'm about to do something stupid. Oh, the live long day. Hi. Alright. Nope. Oh, don't you fucking shoot me. Perfect. Yeah, I bet you liked that, didn't you? Fucking. I think get really better at those. The quick. Ugh. I'm thrown off by, like, the long attacks. Oh god, a fourth man has entered. <laughs> Player five has entered the fucking fight. Um, there's, like, the quick attacks that I don't really see coming. There's not as much. I don't notice the um, how they're projecting that attack as much, as well as like the really long wind-up attacks. I see all the projecting, but I still jump in too early on that. Well, that was the plan, so... Get in there. Fuck. There it is. Next. Cool, cool. While I'm parrying, apparently I'm still blocking. That's good to know. Nope. Nope. I don't like being surrounded. It's dangerous. Perfect. Come on. No, waited too long. Oh, for fuck the quick ones again. Fuck you. Two down? Alright. Two down. Now it's Poison Boy. Fuck yes. Next. Well, apparently I hurt you a little bit more. Come on. I have a shield, buddy. Shield bash. Bonk. That's right. I also should start using my shield bash more often. It just seems like a good idea. That really didn't gain me as much experience Aha, as I would hope it was going to. Health injector. I do need more of those because I used a fuck ton of those on the first time I showed up here. Alright. Getting better at the combat every single fight. Let's get the hell out of here. Um... I'm pretty sure we're close to an hour for you guys. I'm over an hour in filming, if I'm looking at this right. But I also fucked up a lot of combat. So I'm going to go turn in this quest. And that's what we're going to call the end of the episode. Just finishing that side quest. Which I'm probably just going to... Whoa, garbage can! It's going to run there, and there's not really going to be much to show. So, can I climb over this? I can. Fuck yes. There we go. I had found the way I wanted to go. And inside was beggar's rags! I found someone's beggar's rags. Which are crap. Which I mean, I'd be shocked if they weren't. If you find a set of beggar's rags that are really good equipment... Ooh, I like that. I really like the variation on the knives. Can't really... Yeah. Need agility to use a lot of that. Worker shoes, they're the same. Which, again, isn't that surprising. But then I need strength to be a good guardian, as well as constitution. Makes some sense, it just bugs me. I want to be able to focus on my con. Hey, I uh, did the thing. Zachariah, a pleasure as always. What may I do for you? I did the thing. Uh, rumors. I finally managed to meet the merchants you told me about. Yep. It wasn't easy. The mob kidnapped them for serum. Yeah. freed them before talking to them. That's not I'm true. I'm sure gratitude helped to loosen their lips. 
So what knowledge was gleaned from such I, I did talk to the foray. I just didn't feel like paying. ...running large-scale excavations along the shadow paths near our territory, and in the process, uncovering important objects, maybe even a relic. Oh, right, Aurora's abundance is this guy's. Aurora Fine, is the other no ones. better off in our hands than those of Aurora's technomancers. Aurora... Keep those merchants close, Zachariah. Information Wait. like that is such a priceless commodity. You are no more free to roam than the rest of us. Of that I have no doubt. But if you find yourself with access to a rover and perhaps find a way to that excavation site and locate the relic, well, you cannot know the value it might hold if brought back to us. It may seem petty. It's a mission for some rusty relic that may or may not even exist. However, if you are able to slip away from Ophir... Okay. Wasn't... So the POW camp at the beginning of Mars Warlogs was run by Aurora, wasn't it? Because all the POWs were from Abundance, but these guys are Abundance? I'm confused. Ask about the digs on Aurora. Uh, they attacked the Aurora site. No, I think we're good. I got new equipment. You gave me something? You gave me pants? You gave me Techno Pants. I need two power. Makes sense. They just look like jeans. You also leveled me up. That's actually much more important. Um, huh. Can it several enemies? Ooh, that's good. Mace disruption. What is my mace disruption ability at the moment? Yeah, whatever. Let's go with this. Do I want to have it be an automatic critical because I'm already focusing on trying to get the timing right? Or do I want to make it easier to get the timing right? Because, I mean, making that window bigger does sound helpful, but I like just getting good and making the damage be worth it. Um, and I gotta go strength. Just to increase the power of some things I have. There we go. What's interesting is strength is for hand-to-hand, -hand, but there is no stance for hand-to-hand. -hand. <laughs> that's why. Alright, uh, do I have... Did I have another... I didn't. I thought I had actually gotten something that I couldn't use and required strength. Maybe I just sold it. Yeah, alright. I guess I only have things on me for agility. But I have viable things. Whatever. Um, so we're gonna go outside. Uh, hold on. Before we do that. Uh, do So that... What? Go to the extraction site. God damn it, really? Oh, wait for access to a rover to get to the extraction site. Okay, so I have to do other stuff before I'm allowed. Makes sense. So basically, I have to complete other missions and eventually to be like, Hey, uh, you got access to this rover. Go where you want. Okay, I'm going to go do the quest you want me to do. Yeah, that's why we gave you the rover. Yes. That is why I'm going to do that. I have to stop going. <laughs> I'm just going to keep running and keep doing stuff, but that's the end of this episode. I'm pretty sure we've already ran a little bit long. Not a lot, but probably a little long. Um, but that's the end of this episode. I uh, hope everyone's enjoying Technomancer so far. I'm excited to see where this goes. Because, like, the dialogue may be a little bit clunky. The combat may be a pain in the ass to learn, but I find that the, the combat is not just, di like, in the first game, Mars Warlogs, it was difficult to learn, unforgiving as shit, and not consistent. I'm finding this is way more consistent in combat, and it's literally just unforgiving. Like, you just have to get good, because it is not going to, like, give you a chance to make mistakes. Like, you have to not fuck up, which is going to take practice, and basically I have to play more defensively. Um, which is going to make combat slower, but that, I mean, I did say I build tank characters so that I can... F combat takes longer, but I win, so I just have to play that way instead of playing like I'm being aggressive. Um, but that's the end of this episode of Technomancer. The next episode, we're going to actually do the main quest, which is... Fighting for Abundance. Um, and, yeah. We're going to do stuff. Should be fun. That's for later. For now, you have yourselves a wonderful night. No, yeah, it was definitely they went back to Aurora, and that's where everything went wrong. So does that mean Abundance and Aurora both have dowsers and shit? 
weird. They're all dealing with the exact same things, but that seems wrong. I feel like there's something wrong with this story and how it meshes with the other story. Or maybe I'm just remembering Mars Warlocks wrong. I don't know. Either way, that's the end of this episode. You guys have yourselves a wonderful night.